Okay guys, so I thought I'd just give you a quick walk through with my mini power hammer that I made. Um, yeah, so this was basically getting from Clay Hayes Design. I spoke to him. That was last year before I started making it. Um, it wasn't exact half scale build of his. I just got some ideas obviously from his. Another fellow on YouTube that I've used, uh, Big Dog Forge, the guy's called. He's made a power hammer called Scrappy the Power Hammer. So I took some design ideas from him to watching his videos. They're really useful, so um, that was really helpful. Just figured I'd just show you a quick sort of walkthrough of the, uh, the hammer. Obviously, this is a miniature, miniature power hammer. This was originally designed before I built the forge that I'm at now. I was given an opportunity to build the forge here and um, set up. This was originally designed to just be at home in the garage. Um, well, actually, at me. Um, it was my brother's the double garage he was willing to let me use. Um, out in the sticks, really. There's not many people that live around. Well, there isn't anyone that lives around him, so it would have been ideal. Really. But it was just more of a space saver. Um, but just a bit quicker than using, obviously, a conventional hammer. A lot of repetitive work. I wanted it for doing like scrolling. You can see where it's firing up, obviously. You can see the brake kicking in. It works off the pedal. That's similar to, obviously, the uh, Clay Hay Hay's uh, tire hammer. And obviously it's, it's strip this down and move it by yourself. Um, I have since obviously making this hammer and modifying it, bought a 40 kilogram um, air hammer. It obviously needs restoring, so I need to fix that up. But this works great, I'm really, really happy with it. This is the sort of uh, work you can expect from it. This is one of the blades, kitchen knives that I just drew out. Uh, from 6mm. Oh, so that's the finished product of the knife. So yeah, like any questions, just get in touch or leave a comment. I'll get back to you.